George. 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 All right, open up shop. Jo Prickly Honey. Pete subscribed for 36 months and says more fight J. June is after Oh, me. look. It's Prickly Pete with a 36-month subscription. Maybe if Morph had your dedication, he wouldn't be such a weakling with his pneumonia. Morph, hi, back at you. I had pneumonia in January. Can you update your files? Please, you short-ass little foxy fuck. Good afternoon, sir. I almost thought you were bald then for a second, but don't worry, I see you have a mohawk. It's all looking fine. Everything's looking fine. Alright, so what was that? That's it. No. Oh, oh. No. So, um, due to you talking shit, I am afraid you're not coming in. Your mum's making a big mistake. Jo- Next. So you left you- So you left you- Good afternoon, sir. Could I have your papers, please? Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Nice day today, right? Bold. <laughs> sir, can you remove your hat, please? Sir, could you remove your hat, please? Remove your... Okay. I was just checking. No one ever sneaks things into their luggage. Kind of pissing me off, to be honest. I expect it to be finding much more criminals. Car looks fine. Everything looks great, sir. Honestly. Uh, thanks for stopping by. You're not coming in. Next! Come in! Next time, sir. Close your door and take your hat off. Good afternoon, sir. How's it going? Loving the mutton chops. Doesn't make you look like an absolute twat. Absolutely doesn't. We've been promoted again. Fantastic. We do deserve it. We've been working hard. Everything seems to be in order. Everything seems to be in order. We might have to let this guy in. Cargo's looking good. His name is fine. Passport details look okay. Car's in good condition. He's a tailor. What are the degenerates? Teachers, that's it. You're not a teacher, sir, so... You're obviously not a threat to this country. We'll be laying you in. Have a fantastic day, Martin Chops. Next! Come up! Good afternoon, mustache. Get out of the fucking car. I won't ask again. I don't even care about your papers yet. Suspicious. Oh, hello. Hello. Really? I'm sorry. I have something. Please take this money and let me go. How much money is it? How much? $400, Graham. <sighs> Shove your $400 right up your ass! Give me your papers. Ilez Notkin. Stupid name. April the 19th. Yep, that's gone. Yep, you're not having that either. Let's see what we've got in the back. There's no way he's hiding one carton of cigarettes. Gotta be some more stuff going on here. One car- who hides- whoa, 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 what's that? Who hides one carton of cigarettes? One. One! This guy must have some dodgy shit in here. One carton of cigarettes. Whoa! What have we got here then? Stay right there. <gasps> George! I knew you were all right. It's good to see you. I've missed you. Oh, 
George is back. There we have a knife. All right, fantastic. God, George, I knew you were all right. He was obviously just went and wa watch your ass. Watch your ass. He was just walking it off. He's absolutely. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. 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 Whoa! Whoa! Oh, look at you, weak human. Still whining about January's pneumonia. If you were as strong as Zed, you'd have fought it off ages ago. But alas, you're just a softy. I asked him that question about two hours ago. Guys, as annoying as Pixie is. Um, sir, uh, bad news. You're going to jail. Clean it up, please, Graham. George, send in the next one, George. <laughs> It does open, sir. Oh, it does smell quite bad in here, sir. Uh, have you got a bit of IBS, maybe? A little bit stinky? Maybe you had a few too many beans for dinner today? Yeah, well, don't worry about it. It's okay. It happens to the best of us. Flat tire, sir. Two flat tires. We're not going to kick you out for two flat tires, but it's pretty embarrassing. You're driving across a border with two flat tires. Are you... Silly little bald man. No broken lights. Wing mirrors look fine. I don't know if there's a bumper missing there. Who knows? The car's so shit. Who even has a bumper on this car? Well, sir, you can uh, you have a great day. Enjoy my country. Be on your best behavior. No problem. Have a great day. Oh, so one last thing. You better have left your door open, sir. So your door's open. Sir, you've left your door open, sir! Successful day's work, everybody. Can't be bothered dropping you off, if I'm honest. You can just stay in there. Alright, everybody, it's time for an early night. George, get to bed. Early night, boys. That was a good day. I bet Zed would get banned from Overwatch chat as well. Shit! These motherfuckers. I got him. Go on, peek. Bang. God. What? That guy's invulnerable. Make it a run for it! George! Oh! Come on! Come on! Who fucking wants some? Come on! Shit, that guy's in the Matrix! Is that Neo? Bye! Bye! Jesus! Hit your fucking shots, George! That wasn't me! Fucking that wasn't me! Any looters? Any looters? Again. George! Send it another one! Have a great day. Enjoy the country. Your door's open. Your door's open! Okay. Good afternoon, sir. You look like a guy now. He's called Matthew McCoty. He's, uh, expiration date. He's not coming in. Straight out the gate. He's not coming in. He doesn't know this yet. 
Charlie Oscar, Charlie Kilo. This idiot's not getting in. He doesn't need to know. Have a look at your uh, cargo, sir. Just having a quick peek at the cargo. Whoa. Oh! Smuggling! Smuggling too, sir! Piece of shit! Hey! 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 No! Sir! He's making a fucking run for it! Charlie Oscar, Charlie Kilo, we have a runner. We I repeat, we have a runner. We are in hot pursuit of what we can only describe as a thieving piece of shit. Oh, he's left his cargo behind as well. This guy's a true criminal. He could be anything. He's probably a murderer. He's probably like trying to bang his sister or something. Oh, it's a fucking tree! Reversing! Charlie Oscar, Charlie Kilo, we have hit a tree, but it's not a problem. We're continuing our pursuit. We are on our way. We will find him. We will chase him. And we will kill him. I don't have a lot of money. But I do have a very specific set of skills. I can masturbate into a cup from like 15 feet away. Oh, fuck! Who put that pile on there? I think his car's like turbocharged or something. It's insane. Probably the fastest car I've ever seen in my entire life. I think he's driving a Lamborghini. Charlie Oscar, Charlie Kilo, we are coming up upon the assailant. We are going to take him out and we're going to kill him for our country. He looks like the kind of guy who would hide three sausages inside of his prison pocket, not just one. Three and probably two raccoons. Get out of the fucking car! Get out of the fuck! This motherfucker! Shortcut. What could possibly go wrong? Quick shortcut. Oh, that's a gap closer. Still getting further away. I can't get him. I need a faster car. How is he this fast? Guys, don't worry about it. Don't shoot your guns at him or anything. I'll get him. Fucking hell. Got two people in crow's nests. Hit him like Legolas. This time. But he's going back to the prison. He's an idiot. Uh, 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 uh! Holy shit! <laughs> Where the fuck? Where? Where the? Okay, we got this. We got this. I, I'm, I'm very fit. I'm very healthy. I can make it. I can get over to him. I can get this. It's not like he can drive away from us. It's not like he can go anywhere. We've pinned him in with our superior driving skills. We've pinned him in. And he, he's no way he's getting out. Charlie Oscar, Charlie Kilo, we have been forced to leave our vehicle, but no, don't worry. We're Usain Bolt and we've caught up with him. Get out of the car! Get the fuck out of the car! I don't get paid enough for this shit, sir. I always get my man. I like the man from Del Monte. I don't suffer from terrible body odor. We turn the siren off. But where the hell is he? All right, dickhead. You're free to go. Get to jail. Don't worry, George. I've got him. Graham, everything's all right. George! Next! Unfortunately, sir. I gotta go. But you're not getting in. You're making a big mistake. Trust me. Trust me! Oh, and uh, one last thing before you go, sir. One last thing. I forgot to mention, you left your door open, so your car door's open, so you left your door open, sir, so your car door's open, sir, so you left your door open, sir, so your car door's open, sir, so you left your car door open, sir, you left your fucking car door open! Right, sorry, we gotta go. We're in a rush. We have to go. We have to go. We gotta go. Good afternoon, sir. What exactly has happened to you? Where's the body? 
Anyone seen a body? What? It was underneath, they said, right? What does underneath mean? We have to search the body. And the body is located. The body is located. The body is located. The body is located. The body was found by a cleaner at the back of the building. Okay, all right. Okay, okay, okay. Hey. No. Oh, we have a pocket watch. Maybe I can sell that for something. VM are the initials. Virgin Media did it. I knew him. Get, get Branson. Get him. Oh, you've moved corners. I like it. You've always got to keep moving when you're playing FPS games. I'm supposed to stay home with my sick father. He's been feeling worse lately. The cleaner was very suspicious. He wanted us strangely all evening and tried to eavesdrop. Suspicious cleaner. Yesterday we overdid it on the booze. There was a lot to celebrate. Oleg was so happy that the promotion that he even wanted to clear some debt from me. I have no idea who would have wanted Oleg dead. VM. Oleg kicked us out. I felt like killing him. This damn watch has been in my family for generations. I may have said more than I should have, but I would never hurt this bastard. Remember to talk to Timur. He's been acting weird since yesterday. We've been working together for 10 years. I can't believe he's dead. I'm sure the bastard Sahaya have killed him. Oh, like a lot of debt to repay. Some guys in the butcher's shop came in to throw back a few. Nothing special until the cleaner came to tell me about he found in the back. He's pale as a ghost. Where's the murder weapon? I bet the murder weapon was by his body somewhere. Where's he going? Where's he taking us? Oh, we're on to you. Oh, we're on to you. There it is. Kitchen knife. Comes from the inn kitchen. I knew it! It was the chef! Let's check for some more UV on people. Let's check for some more spunk on people. Hey, you got spunk feet? Hey, spunkio. Also, where's the kitchen? Uh, oh, you're the cleaner. I tried to take out the trash. It turned out the warehouse door was locked and the keys were gone. I went around and found the body. Earlier I saw the one who was dead had a fight with the guy in the beret while playing cards. He was a French person! I knew it! Knew it was the French person. What's my decision? Let's release Timur and the cleaner. They are innocent. Let's release Petrosky and the bartender. They are innocent. Let's release Sahaya and Morin. They are innocent. Jesus. How do we know who's innocent here? We're letting the cleaner go home, right? What are we missing here? They do look like boots, don't they, instead of sneakers. He was fighting with someone just before he died. Playing cards with them. Locate the garden area. Petrovsky and the bartender. 
They're going free. If I get bonked on the head of the garden air again, so help me. Hey, 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 is it you? I mean, hey, murderer. I went to get the bottle. I saw the cleaner walking behind the building. He looked like he was trying to hide something under his clothes. Mm-hmm. Where's he gone? Guests moved to the mansion around six. They left a terrible mess. I went out for a cigarette and saw one of the guests walking back to the building. I think they called him Timur. Timur suggested they move outside. I barely made it to the gazebo. I blacked out on the spot. I was sitting under the gazebo and the booze ran out. Timur went to the bar to get a bottle and Oleg had to go to the toilet behind the building because... One of the bar was closed. Jager fell asleep and was left alone with Nikita. Oh, it's so obvious who it is. It's so obvious. Don't you dare bonk me. Dare bonk me. Searching. Oh, you get a hundred dollars for finding files. Easiest hundred dollars of my life. I am still searching. I am still searching. It's a good job I'm such a great border. Co I am still searching. We are still. Mamma mia! As per your order, I figured out Oleg Bogdanov and I confirm his connection with the KGP. Snitch will die today. Long live the free Akaristan Timur. Oh. Hands up, bitch! Oh, bar. Okay, that was me, but don't feel sorry for him. He's just a snitch because of such filthy bastards. My wife and many innocent people are in prison. But put him in prison then! Oh, kill him, big ears! You just call me a puta. You're going straight to jail, mate. In desperation, Timmer pulls out a knife hidden in his shoe and swings at you. Thanks to the quick reaction of Sergeant Bykov. George! You come out of the situation unscathed. The killer. Wounded by gunshot, ends in the hospital, awaiting his trial.